Hey squad, welcome back to another Sea of Thieves video. Today what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be talking through how you guys can get your hands on some generous and humble gifts that were recently added in the Festival of Giving update. And there's a cracking storm going on at the moment, hopefully it's going to pass in a second. Anyway, uh, so first things first, you need to head to Stitcher Gym in any outpost or any tavern in any outpost and you need to browse the black market and you need to look for these so again like the ashen key seeker voyages you have gift seeker voyages one for each area of the map except the devil's roar i am currently at plunder so i'm in the ancient isles so i need the ancient isles one again zero doubloons doesn't cost you anything and i've already do stocked my ship up i did that in advance so we're gonna head to my ship and what you need to make sure you do guys is you will 100% need to make sure you stock up on cannonballs and I'll explain why in a little bit. So, as always, place the voyage down, there's only me, so voting on it. And then what you'll notice is all of the gifts are on forts, okay? Now they're not all going to be active, so you don't need to worry as much. So as you can see, that's a fort, and I'm pretty sure that's going to be Lost Gold Fort, which is right there. So, oh, hang on, why is my boat creaking? Oh, I've got lots of water. Hang on, hold up. Let's get rid of that. So Lost Gold Fort is, well, west by northwest, I guess. So we're going to head over there and see what's in store for us. So, I'll see you in a second. Right squad, we're here. We're at Lost Gold Fort, and as long as my boat stops moving. Why is my boat moving? I don't really want to drop anchor, but... Okay, we'll just drop anchor for now. That's fine. So, we're gonna head onto the fort. Now, again, it's not an active fort, so you don't have to worry about going through waves and waves. So, let's see if... Oh, apparently there should be one... There should be one right here. Uh, I think. I'm normally pretty good at getting these. Normally pretty good at getting these. First go. Uh... Yeah, I'm going to go with it being about here. Whoop! So we've got a humble gift, okay. And I've got skellies. Shouldn't be a, too much of a problem. Alright, alright, oh, alright, jeez. Okay. One second. So we have a humble gift. These are the least valuable of the gifts. So the humble gifts give you five doubloons, usually, unless there's special uh, quests going on. The other one should be... No, that's too far in. Uh, where's the tree? Oh, okay, the tree's there. That looks too... That looks too far in. Uh, um, let's go with here. Oh, we've got a generous gift. Awesome. So these ones, you can slightly tell the design difference. They're obviously black and gold, and the box is slightly whiter. So they're, and they're slightly bigger as well, I think. Yeah, so there you go. That's your generous gift, and that's your humble gift. We've got one more to find on this fort, and it's round... No, I can't go easily, but we'll go around the top. It's just around... Uh, here, if it looks things. Yeah, I'm going to go with here. Yep. So that's those three. Final chapter. Just gonna, I'm going to run these back onto my boat. It's just going to be easier. 
and we'll see where we need to go next. Uh, let's have a look, let's have a look, let's have a look, let's pop that down there. Next map. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, let's have a look. Oh, crow's nest, here we go. So we need to go to crow's nest fortress, which is directly east. Right, I'll load these up, guys, and I'll see you there in a minute. Okay, squad, right, I'm now here at Crow's Nest Fortress. I'm just keeping an eye on that brig over there, so we will work quickly. So, same thing again. It's not an active fort, so we don't have to worry about going through waves and waves of skellies. We just need to work quickly and effectively to get the gifts. Which I'm going to go here. Yep, and skellies. Oh, lots of them this time. Quickly get rid of these guys. This one's being annoying. There we go. So we've got another humble gift. So we'll pop that here. Uh, then there was one this side of the shore. Uh, it might actually be right. No, it's over here. Uh, little rock in front of us. Yep. The grass patch there. Grass patch here. So it's gonna be about here. Oh, we've got another generous. Oh, well, oh, hello. We've got our... We've got our pirate lord. Let's get out of the way of him. Now, this is why... I was not expecting that. It took me by surprise. This is why I was saying make sure you've got plenty of cannonballs because you are going to need to use them. So... Because it's just going to make life... I might be a bit too close here. Oh, wow, he's actually hitting me. Okay. I'm going to make sure I heal up because he's going to pop me off on the cannons. Oh... I was not ready for this. Oh, he's really close now. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, can you, like, go away, please? That would be very helpful. Let's get my eye of reach out. Uh, uh, this one. Where's he gone? Oh my, oh my days. Okay, right. Let's get organised. Can he, like, go away? Uh, have I got any throwables on me? No. Let's get the fireballs. Ooh, good shot. Here, have some of that. There you go. Yeah, let's light him up. There's another one. Oh, jeez. He's doing me a lot of damage. Might be worth just trying to get him on to... Might, might be worth just trying to get him near a keg. But I haven't had time to set that up, so... This is proving rather interesting. Oh, I'm out of ammo, because I'm a moron. Okay, now he's up there. I can hit him with cannons. Here we go. Now he's in position. He's dead. Oh, hey, there we go. <laughs> Not the cleanest uh, offense I've ever had against a skeleton captain or lord, but there you go. And we've got a skeleton order as well. Sick. So, villainous skull. We'll ping that up onto the ship. Keep, make sure we keep an eye out. No, it doesn't look like there's anyone. Cool. Uh, we still have one last gift to find, actually. Uh, where was it? The other one was up top, I believe. Yeah, 
this up here. Uh, just here, I'm thinking. Yep, seems pretty solid. Voyage complete, there we go. But it's not the only thing we've got left to do, so... I'll show you the rest. Gift Seeker of the Ancient Isles. Whoop! Okay, so that's... Actually, we've got more generous, or generous gifts than I was expecting. Let's just fill out this... Oh, it's on the other side. Okay. We'll just do this skeleton orders. Uh, which is around here somewhere, I believe. Uh, actually, I think we're pretty much spot on. And we've got a... Third generous, that's fantastic. Right, so, once I get this back to my ship, I will show you what you need to do for the final part, because the final part is somewhat the most difficult. Because now that we've got them all, we need to go hand them in. Now, what you don't do is you don't hand them in to stitch your gym like you normally would. We need to go find the masked stranger, and she is at the Reaper's hideout. So we need to go... Where are we now? We're down here. So we need to go northwest up to the Reaper's hideout. That's where we're going to get to hand in our goodies. So I'll load up again, sail over, and see you in a second. Right, squad, we're here. We have arrived. I'm just going to drop my anchor just to make life easy for myself. We have reached Reaper's hideout. And... Have I just hit something? I don't think I have. Uh, so as you can see, there's the Christmas tree in the middle. Or oh, the makeshift Christmas tree, I guess. And all you need to do is take your gift. Make sure no one else is here. I don't think anyone else is here. I was waiting for a ship to leave, but they I think they scuttled. And just head up to the central point. And you will find the Masked Stranger. There you go. And that's all you do is just sell your wares, your gifts to the Masked Stranger. And that's it. Now, a couple of tips. One, be careful when you're approaching Reaper's Hideout. Just because this is the only place where the Masked Stranger can be found. So, anyone who's doing generous gift or gift voyages... Um, they will have to come here to hand in, so you can either use that to your advantage or not, but um, always just check to make sure that there's no one else wandering around. If you are um, in a galleon with a good crew and you're confident, or if you're on your own and you're quite confident, then by all means you can go ahead and just blast your way in, But um, so just be warned about that. The other thing I haven't mentioned is there are other ways of getting gifts beyond just the voyages. And the main way now is forts have been updated that they have gifts in the vaults. Uh, so when you open the vault with the vault key, you will find some gifts inside for you as loot, as a reward for completing the fort. So um, I'm going to save you the mundaneness, if that's even a word, of me unloading my ship the whole time. Well, squad, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, I hope you've, I've given you everything that you need to know with regards to how you can find yourselves some generous and humble gifts scattered across the Sea of Thieves. If you enjoyed the video, then please make sure you leave a like, you head over to Installation X, subscribe, and you hit that bell for notifications for future uploads. And as always, I'm Sykes, and for more on Sea of Thieves and all things Xbox, stay tuned to Installation X. Bye, guys.